Hello, my name is Reed Redden and I'm a sheep and goat specialist for Texas A&M AgriLife Extension. We're here today to demonstrate a uh, pregnancy ultrasound with sheep. Uh, this is a, a tool that, that ranchers can use to help them determine which animals are pregnant and we can also determine how many pregnancies that they're carrying. This is especially important with ewe lambs. Uh, ewe lambs is where the group of animals or yearlings for that matter, uh, then when we put the bucks out we may not get as good a breed up rate and so we need to be able to manage those differently. Uh, for mature animals we typically get a good pregnancy rate but we may need to sort those that are going to lamb in the early part of the lambing season versus the later part of the lambing season into separate pastures or pens. Uh, this technology also allows us to sort use mature ewes um, or ewe lambs that are going to have singles from those that are going to have twins and this kind of coincides with our last facebook live video where we were talking about body condition and score so this technology allows us to know which animals are going to require more nutrients so that we can continue to keep them in the appropriate body condition score so that they have the, the best ability or the best chance of raising their offspring um, based on a nutritional status. And so here we'll demonstrate this. Um, there's a number of different ways that pregnancy ultrasound can be done. Uh, some of them can use rectal for spe specifically if we're looking at early pregnancies. Uh, some can detect them as early as 25 days, um, 25 to 35 days. For the abdominal ultrasound that we're going to demonstrate today, uh, this technology we normally like the pregnancies between 45 days of pregnancy and 90. If they're younger than 45, sometimes it's a little bit harder to find those pregnancies. And if they're older than 90, the lambs get so big in the abdomen, it's hard to locate them with this and determine how many they have. So that 60 days is ideal, but anywhere from 45 to 90, uh, most technicians and veterinarians can, can do this with a lot of ease. So we use a lubricant. We come into the flank, uh, go up high in the flank for, for younger pregnancies. Um, we're gonna get him, it's great to have somebody that restrains the animals for us. And we're looking for black, uh, the black on the screen, that's fluid. Um, and so I've located the uterus, and you can see at the top of the screen is, is the part of the uterus that's fluid filled, which is the black, and then the white in the middle is the lamb, kind of towards the top of the screen, and the bright white is the umbilical cord. Okay, so that's uh, a lamb, and we'll continue to search through the whole uterus and then we can find the other pocket on the other side. Uh, sheep, have, sheep and goats have two uterine horns and then there is the other lamb uh, in this, um, the other uterine horn. So uh, at this stage of pregnancy, we can find both of them. They're pretty small, pretty easy to locate. And uh, this is a ewe lamb that uh, is gonna have twins, her, her first lambing. She's also growing, so we definitely wanna manage this ewe with a little extra feed resources if our forage out in the pastures aren't ideal so that she can maintain a good body condition and can su successfully raise those twins. So continue to follow our uh, Facebook page and our weekly posts. Thanks, have a great weekend.